Mohammed, uh, welcome to Dubai. Uh, Thank you. And for given fighting lifestyle UAE this time and your time to do this interview. Right. Yeah. So, I'd like to start, uh, Mayor Mohammed, with a, a couple of questions, please. Uh, what brought you here to train in Dubai? Uh, actually, I came here to, to help Sheikh Tariq his training mm -hmm. for the Hamadan, Mohammedan's game. And I think he's he going to train on the 1 a.m. And I came okay. to, to help me and Davi, Davi Ramos and a few more guys coming mm -hmm. to, to help this train. This train. Yeah, yeah, and when did you arrive in, in Dubai uh, recently? I arrived, arrived the day before yesterday. The day before mm -hmm. yesterday. So Tuesday. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, so you arrived yeah, yeah, yeah. on Tuesday? Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Nice. Nice. And how are you finding Dubai? Have you trained here apart from Sheikh Tariq? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I stay here one month. I think mm -hmm. uh, at the 20 July I I returned to Rio. So 20 July you're going yeah. back to, to yeah. Rio. So yeah, you'll yeah. be here for a month. Oh, excellent. Well, again, welcome, welcome to Dubai. It's, <laughs> it's a you. pleasure to have you. Yeah. Uh, okay, so what got you into BJJ when you first started BJJ as a child? Uh, yes, I I start I start my training at December 2009. Mm -hmm. I think yes. I, I started because I was very weak, weak yeah. and, and I, I, I need to practice some sports, you understand? Yeah. Yeah. And I always liked fighting, but never, never did, I don't know why. Uh, and I start BJJ and love it. Yeah, yeah. So you, you just you, you were a very active child, <laughs> should we yeah. say? And uh, <laughs> but you didn't like to go and do weights or anything like that. Yeah. You, you, when you found BJJ. Yeah, and and, uh, and again, I think thirty five kilos. Thirty five. <laughs> wow! Yeah. Wow! I was small too. Small. So you were a small yeah. kid, small <laughs> child. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not so small now. Eh? <laughs> yeah. So you've it's done good. It's done good. So, uh, who's, who's influenced you in your career, from uh -huh. your BJJ career? Who's uh, influenced you the most, would you say? Yeah, I, I, I like a lot of guys, a lot of fighters uh, from MMA or from BJJ, but I'm sure the Minotaur is the number one. Yeah. Uh, before I know him, I, I cry seeing his fighters. Mm. And after I know, I like more this yeah. guy's yeah. fantastic yeah. man he, yeah. he's helped me and man mm -hmm. I, I I learned a lot of things with him would you say he's helped you not only with BGG but has he helped you outside of BGG yes. in life in general yeah 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 yeah, yeah. 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 he yeah. now I live in his house in Brazil mm -hmm. uh, he have a apartment for athletes Right. And I live there. Yeah, nice, yeah. nice. So you, nice. you live with other athletes yeah, and it allows yeah, you yeah. to train under Nagara. Yeah. And, and yeah, so, yeah, so yeah. He's, he's been a big, big influence. Is there anybody else, you know, with within the BGG community who you like? You know, you, actually, you, you, you like actually a lot. the guys live there, lives there uh, is the MMA fighters. I'm, I'm the just BJJ fight living there. Mm, right. Yeah. Right. Great yeah. opportunity. Yeah. You mentioned Buchetta and BJJ Pen earlier on when yeah. we were discussing. Yeah. You know, yeah. I like I like a lot of guys from BJJ. Uh, I watch the new guys or the old guys. I like Terere. I like the uh, Margarida. Yeah. The Minotaur, Minotaur fighting yeah. there. Yeah. Good. And the new generation, I like Buchecha. Uh, like Cobrinha, like a lot of guys. Yeah, so. yeah. So you know, it sounds like you, you're like a mix of old guys, yes, new guys. Yes, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, overall, good BJJ yeah, players. Yeah, yeah. Mainly, and, and the main influence has been has been Nagara. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I like Jorge Grace a lot. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah a lot. His yeah, game good, is good, good. Yeah. Now it's been it's rumored you've recently changed teams. Yeah. Is this true? And if so, why did you change? No, actually, I didn't change my team. Yeah. Actually, I just make my my camp to the words at the Lodge Eve in Maryland. Mm -hmm. But I not change my team. It's because Team Nogueira in Rio not a BJJ Academy. It's a MMA okay. team, yes. you understand? Yes. And I, I need... Uh, BJJ team to compete 
in high high level. Yes, so, yeah, yeah. And I did, I I talked to Rodrigo Minotauro, and he say, man, go there, learn and fight and win. Mm -hmm. And I I went there and I win the words, but yeah. not not change my team. I just right. yeah. make a camp, and I have to thanks a Lloyd, a, a Rodrigo, everybody helped mm -hmm. me in this in this yeah. career. Yeah, so you you just used it. You didn't change camps, as you see. You just used it as a as a training camp. Uh, yeah, in, yeah, in a, yeah. In a lead up to the world. Yeah, yeah, yes. Just uh, just touching on that, uh, Mohammed. How long was your training camp prior uh, to the world? Yeah, I stayed there one month. One I month. Think. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I think so. Yeah. Maybe one half month. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. four to five weeks. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you re recently won your your division in the worlds, as as a lot of us now know. How does it feel to be a world champion at such a young age? Ah uh, man, <laughs> I can't I can't explain with words, but it's amazing, man. Uh, I every everybody training jiu jitsu uh, in Brazil. Everybody wants to fight words. Mm. Uh, everybody wants, man, one day I want to fight words. The guy don't think win the word, you understand? Yeah. Everybody wants just to fight. Mm. And I can I, I, I have an opportunity to fight and to win the words. Yeah. Yeah. And it's my second. Last year I lost to the guy I, w I w win in, on the final this year. Wow. Wow. Is man mm. amazing, amazing. Yeah, I, mm. I yeah. can't explain with words, yeah. man. But yeah, but yeah. <laughs> so, 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 just leading on from there to the people who want to fight, you know, that your friends and you back in Rio, mm -hmm. all the guys who want and everybody wants to be a world champion. Yeah, everybody, but right. what would you say you've got to do to become a world champion? Nah, man, uh, not secret, man. Train every day. Uh, Learn, learn, teach, help mm. your friend, and if you help, somebody help you, yeah. understand? Mm -hmm. And I, I, I like training, I love it, I, I don't, I don't know man, I just love what I do, yeah. you understand? Is it, is it mainly the training that you love, or is it the competition, you know, which is it, or is it uh, one's as important as the other? I don't know man, actually I love, I always love to train, I, I never think that Ah man, I one day I world champ, one mm. day I go to Dubai, one day yeah. I go. No, I, I start to train just to feel good. You understand? And now I feel good. I can wake up every every day happy, mm -hmm. train happy, and become world champ, become, man. Yeah, amazing. Uh, yeah, Am absolutely amazing. Amazing. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So what lies ahead for your fighting career? What what plans do you have? You know, do, do, are you planning to continue fighting BJJ? Would you like to move into MMA? Mm -hmm. uh, so, I always want to fight MMA. Always. Mm. Uh, actually, when I arrived at the Chino Guerra, the Rodrigo and Rogério told me, man, wait. <laughs> mm, <laughs> you have yeah. 17 years old. <laughs> wait, wait. You don't need to fight now. Stay on the BJJ. Uh, grow in your good body, yeah. your weight, and I don't know, man. I actually, I, I think, is my time. You understand? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now yeah. I, I I have to promote it. I have to be promoted, brown belt, and maybe January. And I now I I want to start to train striking. Yeah. Or, mm -hmm. You understand? Then yeah. training the the cage. And maybe like next next year, I start my career on my way. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't I don't I don't know. I can't I can't uh, I can't say exactly I when. when I, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but I don't know if I want to to continue two three more years mm -hmm. training and competition BJJ whole time yeah. understand yeah. I, mm. I think I, I continue to fight BJJ but not just just, just BJJ, BJJ. BJJ. So, so is it fair to say that you know your career you're looking at a career yeah. move to MMA yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. would that yeah. be would that Love be it, yeah. 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 Mohammed thank you very much for the interview yes,
Uh, is there anybody you would like to to thank? Any sponsors you'd like to thank? To? No, yes, yes. I want to. I want to thank uh, first my family, my mother. Believe me. Uh, I want to thank Brigadeiro when I started my training BJJ. I want to thank Dragos. Uh, Dragos in introduced me at the Rodrigo and mm -hmm. Rogério. I want to thank Tinogueira Recreio. Everybody there training with me. Uh, I want to thank Tinogueira Dubai and Rafael and Chek Tark to invite me to I'm here one more time. I want to thank uh, Tim Lloyd Even. I trained there to be world champion one month. Uh, I want to thank everybody, believe me, everybody send me message on Facebook, everybody motive, motivate me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, man, everybody believe, everybody send me message, everybody believe, everybody yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> everybody. Yeah. Good, 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 good. <laughs> and sponsors, I have a coral, uh, always send me kimonos and clothes and man, support to I fight, to I can fight. Uh, I want to, I want to to thank Influx in Rio because I have a sponsor in Rio is uh, English school. Yeah. And yeah. now I I can make an interview in English. Man, I'm very happy. Uh, yeah. Thanks, yeah. Gloria. Thanks, Influx. Uh, Umidex to everybody help me, man. Everybody Excellent. support me. <laughs> Again, Mohammed, thank you very much for this Oof. interview. And to Fighting Lifestyle UAE fans from Derek Gamblin and Muhammad Ali, thank you very much. Thank you.